Ever wonder how to master that graceful frog-like breaststroke kick? Give me six minutes and I will reveal the secrets of effortless breaststroke kicking within three simple steps. You'll be left wondering why you didn't try this sooner. Hey, I'm Dan, all-American swimmer and owner of a New York City-based swim school. Let's talk about the breaststroke kick. Breaststroke kicking, also known as the frog kicking, this kick simulates frog legs motion. Take a look at this flawless breaststroke kick. Impressive, right? Like this video and hit that subscribe button for a special surprise guest waiting just for you. I'll wait. Okay, thank you. It wasn't that hard, was it? Please welcome our special guest who's about to unveil the secret behind his effortless, effective breaststroke kicking technique. Hopkins, come on in. Hey, uh, can I tell my favorite joke? No, you gotta tell us a secret. Okay. Ensure that you trap the water between your legs during the breaststroke kick. Move the water inward towards the other leg rather than pushing it outwards. When you squeeze the water between your legs, it gets pushed behind you, propelling you forward. Hey, uh, can I tell a joke now? Okay, okay, go ahead. Why don't frogs ever park illegally? Because they're afraid they will get towed away. The joke was pretty lame, but the secret is worth sharing. This technique is ideal for beginners who are just starting to learn the frog kick. The advanced kicking technique will be covered in a separate video, so if you are a beginner, pay attention and take notes. Now, this is how you trap the water between your legs. Let's break down the breaststroke kick into three separate steps. Bend your knees outwards as you bring them to the sides, making sure they don't go higher than your hips. As you bring your knees out, point your toes in opposite directions while keeping your ankles flexed upwards. Push the water out behind you forcefully, moving the water with the back of your feet. By the end of this step, your legs should be fully extended and separated. Extend your toes behind you and use your entire leg to squeeze the water by moving one leg towards another. Remember, you have to trap the water between your legs. Let's repeat the steps. Knees out, open your legs, squeeze the water. Out, open, squeeze. Out, open, squeeze. If the breaststroke kick is done correctly, it will produce plenty of propulsion. Timing is the key to effective propulsion. Let me break it down for you. Let's count together. Count one when you bring your knees out, two as you push the water out and squeeze it in, three, four, five as you keep your legs close to each other and glide. As you may have noticed, we have connected the second and third step to ensure we trap the water between our legs for the best propulsion. One, knees out. Two, move the water. Three, four, five, glide. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Start exploring this kick while holding to the wall. Count your steps. Use your hip flexor during the first step hamstrings and glutes with the second step, adductor muscles during the third step. One, two, three. One, two, three. If you struggle to hold the wall and keep your legs up, practice this drill with your stomach positioned above the water on the pool deck. Move on to the next drill where you do it with your face in the water while keeping your arms in front. One, two, three.
three, four, five. Make sure to trap the water between your legs during the second step. Give yourself some time to glide after each kick. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. You can do the same drill with the kickboard face in or out of the water. If you're swimming with your face out, your glide should be shorter. If you keep your face in, glide longer. Make the breaststroke kick while floating on your back to spice things up. If you haven't watched my video about back floating, make sure you do it. Keep your knees inside the water while initiating this kick. And don't forget to trap the water between your legs to create more propulsion. Share this video with someone learning breaststroke kicking and subscribe for more swimming content for beginner swimmers. Breaststroke kick is not the only kick we use in swimming. Watch the following video to learn about flutter kicking and hope to see you soon. Bye.